My name is Sandra Metcalf Moore, and um, I came here to see Dr. Gonzalez because I have rheumatoid arthritis. Yes. I've had that for 48 years. Um, I now have an ulcer. From 40, 48 years. 48 years. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, I also have osteoporosis, yeah. really because of the medications I've been on, mm -hmm. and ulcer because of the medications, and now I've also been diagnosed with celiac, which yeah. is I can't eat gluten. Mm -hmm. um, and so uh, let me just see your hands, mm -hmm. which is, which is uh, the main, the main mm -hmm. uh, aff affected the most. Mm -hmm. can, you, can you close and open? And then make, make this move much. much mm -hmm. there, there's a lot. The range of motion is very, very limited, mm -hmm. and, and the same as on this side, mm -hmm. isn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we can see the inflammation process mm -hmm. going on. So we just uh, finished the uh, the treatment, and uh, let's just move your your hands up as mm -hmm. high as can. Also, the the elbows are are uh, mm -hmm. some, uh, 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 the, you know, they kept some flexion mm -hmm. over there. Yeah. So let's see how she respond. Um, she's taking uh, five milligrams of uh, prednisone, um, the Plaquenil, mm -hmm. and uh, many other yeah. medications. Um, uh, so, so let's see how she does. Um, the adrenal glands are it's kind of uh, suppressed mm -hmm. um, because of the because of the um, the uh, too much prednisone for mm -hmm. some some you know for a long time. And uh, what else? Um. She's not. Is, she's been allergic to all the oh, yes. anti TNF mm -hmm. medications, the Embryol and you know all these mm -hmm. all these medications. Mm -hmm. uh, what else? Uh, so let's really see how she does. Yeah. Also with the skin texture, oh, yes. the hair texture, muscle uh, mass, muscle mass mm -hmm. bone mass because of the osteoporosis. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna have find. We're gonna find ways to measure the success of the mm -hmm. treatment. Uh, Pretty soon. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to say too that you know I was really kind of afraid of the procedure because you know it just you never know uh, the hands in Mexico right? how they are. <laughs> <laughs> and you know coming over was a little scary because of the military. Yes. But um, Pedro was really nice. You yeah. Know, picking yeah us driver. Up. Mm -hmm. Everybody here is just really nice. Dr. Gonzalez takes a lot of time with yeah. you. You just can ask all your questions. Yeah. The procedure, the injections are the least amount of hurting I've ever had in an anesthetic. That's good. And um, so it really was very minor as far as the discomfort or anything. Very good. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so let's see how you do uh, in about six months and uh, up to a year. Mm -hmm. And then and we'll, we'll see we'll see how uh, all the parameters, like uh, also your blood work mm -hmm. and your, your bone density mm -hmm. and how it shows in the future. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, thanks very much. Thank you. <laughs>